G'day everybody and welcome to a, another Star Wars vehicle review. Today we're going to be having a look at the Droid STAP or STAP as they're known. Uh, the Single Trooper Aerial Platform uh, is what STAP stands for, STAP. Uh, you can see there it's just a, a single person vehicle or a single operated person vehicle which is just by one droid. Uh, this particular vehicle is the sneak preview uh, that was brought out by Hasbro uh, before the release of the Phantom Menace to give you a bit of a, as I say, a sneak peek of, of some of the vehicles that we're going to see in the movie or that we were going to see. Uh, a unique vehicle has a nice stand that allows it to um, stand upright and because it's clear it hopefully also hides because obviously in the movie it's uh, a floating vehicle, doesn't rest on the ground. You can see there we have a nice battle droid sort of holding on to the handbars, very good detail within the vehicle. Hasbro was trying to make a good impression coming back onto the Star Wars scene and then we also have the feet nicely locked into the pedal. Looking down the vehicle we have the two engines and we then have these two blasters or missiles that can be fired and I'll show you how to do that in a minute and then moving around to the side. So nice detail, nice colouring, goes well with the AAT battle tank that uh, I've done a review on that I also own as well. But let's get into a little bit of the action. Underneath Hopefully you can see this. Uh, you'll see that there is a button that allows you to push up and down. And if I push that button up and down, you will see that my droid moves forward and launches the missile. So again, I'll, now that I've fired all my missiles, I can just make him dance and move in and firing his missiles. So I suppose it's that recoil action that you would see if you were firing any probably big weapon. Um, so that's pretty much all the button does. You can take it off the stand if you wish. Um, and then to fire the buttons, you just need to push from beneath the STAP. But I think it looks good on the stand. And when you display it next to your, your battle tank or your other vehicles that you probably have, he, uh, he looks quite good. So thanks for watching. I uh, hope you've enjoyed that little review. If you see these, I'd recommend picking one up. I know they re-released them uh, in the Clone Wars. Um, battle pack. I think it's Anakin fighting a droid because we do see one in the, the animated Clone Wars movie and the, throughout the series as well. So they are out there if uh, you're willing to go and have a look for them and depending if you want the Clone Wars version or the, um, the traditional Star Wars uh, saga versions. So thanks for watching, keep subscribing and hope you've enjoyed the reviews to, to date. An update on the Kit Fisto and Kia Mundi mug. Basically they're on their way but uh, just need a few more touch-ups. So it won't be long now. So stay tuned for those ones. Cheers.